something strange is happening in our oceans. From giant squid to mysterious ore fish, these deep sea beings are showing up in unexpected places. Is this a sign of the ultimate apocalypse? Or does the surprise visit of these underwater beings on the surface indicate the rise of the biblical Leviathan? And finally, is it time that Earth starts to live without humankind? Dating back to 17th of February, 2025, a deep sea creature, the anglerfish was seen on the west coast of Spain. This was a unique sight for all humankind, as such creatures don't venture in the light. The anglerfish, also known as the devil fish, lives under 200 meters to 2,000 meters of the ocean. So what caused it to come ashore? The mystery remains unresolved. Japanese myth states oarfish, a creature believed to be a sign of disaster, were spotted near the surface also. This is believed to be an indication of tsunamis, earthquakes, and so much more. Having said that, a living oarfish has been spotted on the shores of Mexico. But why is this happening? Could this be a warning sign of something bigger, something dangerous happening beneath the waves? Before we dive into the dark depths of the ocean, don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow Let Me Tell You. Now, let's get into it. Planet Earth comprises 71% of the oceans, whereas the rest of it is land. The Earth's oceans are conventionally divided into the Pacific, Atlantic, Indian, Arctic. Surprisingly, only 5% of the ocean's depths have been discovered by humankind till date. The rest remain to be discovered. Recent incidents indicate that something uncertain is brewing. What could the possible causes be? One possible explanation is underwater seismic activity. Deep sea creatures live in extreme pressure zones, and when underwater earthquakes or volcanic activity occur, it can disrupt their habitat, forcing them to rise. Cut to animation of tectonic plates shifting, Another cause, ocean warming. Rising sea temperatures mess with deep sea ecosystems, causing species to migrate in search of cooler, more stable environments. This isn't just bad for marine life. It's a warning sign of climate change accelerating faster than we thought. But the real concern, if these deep sea movements are linked to seismic shifts, we could be looking at the early warning signs of underwater earthquakes, tsunamis, or even volcanic eruptions. Scientists are keeping a close watch, but history has shown that nature often gives us signs before catastrophe strikes. So, should we be worried? Maybe. While not every deep sea sighting signals disaster, patterns like these are worth paying attention to. What do you think? Is nature trying to warn us? Let us know in the comments. And remember, stay curious, stay informed, and keep watching Let Me Tell You.